Honestly, it really means a lot to me. Obviously, AJGA events are, are really hard to um, get into, so I'm really glad that I was able to play pretty pretty well in the qualifier and put up a round that I'm proud of. Um, the AJGA has helped me so much in my golf career. I feel like um, I played my first preview last year, and even in the preview, I could see that the fields were a lot more competitive than anything I'd ever played before. Um, you have some of the world's best golfers traveling from international countries to play in these events, and it's it's really it's really awesome just to get to not only play with them, but then kind of see their game and see how I can improve by doing some of the things that they do. So it's really just learning more about the game and playing with better fields. The first time I was tied with uh, one of my friends, so that was it was a lot of fun to see him up there, um, and it felt good. Um, not, it was a little weird being at the top, knowing everyone's chasing me, but it's a little less sleep at night. But it was a it was a fun experience just to be up there. The first round means that no matter what happens the next two days, that I've already accomplished something. So then it also gives me more confidence moving into the next two days to accomplish more. So the course is helpful for me, especially yesterday, and it will be the next two days because it's a lot of wedges and just placement off the tee. So I pride myself on being a good putter and wedge player, and I think that takes advantage here. A lot of shots inside 10 feet, and I made like a lot of them, and I putted really well with the greens. And then even with the rain delay, I feel like the course still like played pretty dry, and it didn't really affect my round that much. My goals for today and the rest of the tournament is to try to um, play smart, limit bogeys, and then try to get birdies. I hit a lot of good iron shots yesterday, so if I do that today I feel like and tomorrow I feel like I'll be good. It means a lot to me because putting a lot of hard work and a lot of effort into just getting here to be at this tournament and to see it all pay off is just really a big a big win for me and I really enjoy just being out here and great weather so it's fortunate. I like, I like playing at AJJ events because it's just so well, well run and organized by all the staff and they're all so nice and it's always a great time being out here. It's always known as the biggest like junior tour out here so it's just fun just being at any AJJ tournament um, no matter where it is. My goal is the 2022 season just to keep playing my best and just see where it takes me. It means a lot to me, especially since I've been coming here since I was like eight or six years old. I've been playing like US Kids tournaments here, so to win here and so close to home, it means a lot. I really love playing AJGA tournaments because they're the best tournaments mostly for junior golf, and they're extremely competitive, and they help me shape to be a better player. Um, my goal was to win an AJGA tournament, and I did, so my goal now is to keep playing well, and I know if I keep playing well, I can maybe win again or play top three again. Good morning, welcome to the final round of the AJGA Junior All-Star Invitational presented by Auburn Open Lake and Tourism. Uh, it went pretty well. I, I hit a lot of fairways and a lot of greens, so it was a pretty steady round. Uh, good. Today was really a perfect round. It was, it was also my best score that I've ever hit. I'm hoping it'll be good, even though today is like the day one, so hopefully we can keep on trucking forward. Yeah, I think this is a great momentum uh, keeper, and I'll uh, be able to play great for the rest of the week. Uh, today was pretty good. I hit the ball well, putted real well. Uh, short game helped me out a lot. Saved myself a couple times. Uh, that, that really helped. I think my rounds were pretty solid. I definitely made some putts, made some good shots. Despite, it, despite the course being a little wet. I think it went pretty well. Um, not all the putts went in. It was really hard to read the greens here, but overall I'm really happy with how I did. I played safe most of the time. I didn't hit it into any hazards or it went OV the whole tournament. So I was really glad about that. I think it went pretty well, and my short irons were pretty good today. And I made a lot of putts. I think that's the key point. It feels great. I mean, I felt really comfortable out there. I was just trying to keep calm and just keep it consistent. I played really well. Um, I think I was just hitting it really straight. Well, I like this course. Um, the wind was a big factor today, and uh, I think I played better. I think my driving was pretty strong. Like I was always, always in the middle of the fairway. Um, other than that, also my putting, I feel like uh, was pretty good uh, throughout the back nine. I think I hit every fairway today, and I was hitting some great drives. Like I started on ten, so it was a part three. It was like one thirty-five, but I was using a gap wedge because it was so strong, and it was just tough. Like, I knew that four strokes back to the lead, I had to 
started off hot and luckily there's a few birdie holes on the front. So I birdied the first three holes and then just tried to make some more birdies, ended up making some putts. I feel really good because this is my last junior all-star event because um, I'm 15 and I'm really happy that I was able to make it. It means something to me and I'm really happy that I was able to come out here and win. This course really suited my game because uh, I could hit short irons off or long irons off the tee and then hit some three woods and not have to bang driver all day long. And I'm long enough but accurate enough with those clubs to I can position myself where I need it to be, which is key on this course. A lot of trouble left and right. And so as a ball striker, I'm a predominantly better ball striker than I am around my short game. And I really could rely on that today, which helped me stay out of trouble. I feel like just definitely the competition of AJGAs is what differentiates it from other um, tournament leagues because you just get the top golfers in the country, especially around New England since we kind of only have local competition besides um, in AJGAs. So it's really fun to get to know other people from around the country and world um, and just play against some really good golfers. It's very excited for me because this is my first time to qualify in an AJGA Open and yeah, I would I will try my best in the next few days tournaments. I thought the course suited me well since I'm playing a draw, a couple holes dog leg left where you need like a good draw on that. And I thought the green suited me well since I like smooth, fast greens. I think my ability to stand pressure really pulled through this week and today especially because I was four down with 10 to play and I knew if I just got some birdies and some putts rolling then I could still have a chance and get the dub, so. This course is pretty tight. Uh, fairways aren't that wide, a lot of dog leg lefts. I'm a draw player, so this course kind of fit my eye and I was able to hit a lot of fairways. I'm just gonna keep on trying to work on a strong mental game, just keep it positive out there, stay focused on what I can control and not worry about what I can't, and hopefully some good results happen. I feel good, I putted well. You know, greens were in good shape, it was fun. I don't know, I, it, it felt good. I didn't look at the scoreboard the whole time, so I didn't know until the end. I was playing well, so I knew I had a chance, but you know, it, it was cool at the end. I think that I focused a lot, and it really helped me for the game, and the course was in good condition, so it was really good. Each hole was really consistent, and overall, it was pretty good. The course was really soft today, so um, I was more aggressive on tee shots, especially with uh, approach shots, too. You can just land it right next to the pin, and it'll kind of just stop. So I just played really aggressive today. I didn't really have to lay back as much, so that, that kind of helped too. I think it helped that I was like in the fairway for most of the time and I was hitting the greens, so all I had to do was putt, really. I mean, I played some great golf today. I made a lot of clutch putt, like 20, 30 feet putt to um, make some birdies and make some pars. Especially on um, 17, I think, I made a birdie from off the green. And then it, it's, made, it's made a lot, as, it's been my um, dream since I was young. Like, um, since I know AJJ, I just want to win um, one tournament before I go to college. So yeah, this um, means a lot to me. I think right when I got done with the 18th hole, I was thinking like, I didn't know I won yet. And so I was a little bit on edge, but I also knew there was nothing else I could have done. So it felt really good. I felt good to know that I came out here and I played my best golf and I did everything I could. It was a really great week. Um, I really liked the course and um, I got second here last year so it was really cool to come back and play well this week to get the win. I guess just all parts of my game just kind of worked well this week. Um, not one in particular really stood out. Yeah. It means um, a lot because I actually got run up three times last year um, and two top three finishes so far so it feels really good to finally get the win. It's just really good for my confidence. Um, it shows that like I can get the win 
and um, hopefully a few more to come. So I've played a lot of tournaments here. I'm, I live about three hours away and I've, play, I've played really well here in the past and um, for whatever reason, don't know why, but um, today I just had a really good day and a lot of putts fell. Yeah, it's a special feeling. Um, winning doesn't happen too often, especially in golf, so um, a lot of things went well today. I've been, I've been really close um, in the past and you know, just for everything to go right today and get the right bounces feels good. It'll definitely give me a little confidence boost going into the rest of the summer. Um, yeah, just good momentum. I've been playing well and I hope to keep it up. I just have to keep practicing, keep missing on the right spots because this course can get really tricky if you do miss in the wrong spots. I really like this course. The greens are kind of like my style. I like putting on them and the course is in overall great condition. I liked it. It's a fun course. Different style than most courses, but it's fun to play. Not too hard, not too easy, but it's challenging in ways. I felt really confident today, and I played really well, and I putted really well, and I'm just going to take that confidence into the three days. It's kind of tough in the morning because I kind of got off to a slow start, but I started making birdies, and then I just kind of lost track and just, you know, just kind of making putts, hitting good shots, and playing smart golf, really. I'm missing the right spots. Like, my bad shots were, like, in the right spots, like, so I just, everything was working really well today. The conditions were cooler today. Um, that's, that was really fun to play other than like the 100 degree weather yesterday and the day before. Um, there were a few really tricky holes today, I have to admit, and some of them really got to me. But overall, I think I played pretty well today. But I love the course. Um, the fairways were in good conditions. The greens were in good conditions, and I just had like a lot of fun out here. I particularly enjoyed hole Three. It was a nice, like, small, short, reachable par five, um, and yeah. Well, I mean, I got off to a hard start, went par, birdie, 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 and um, got rained out on my eighth hole, had, what, four-hour delay, uh, got on the eight, went bogey, bogey, and then was three under at one point, and then bogey, bogey, eight and nine, but I mean, uh, I learned a lot from today, like, especially playing smart golf and missing in the right spots, but um, overall not a bad day. I would like to thank all the sponsors and the volunteers. They have made this event um, very good, and I just love the course. I love their smiles and their just support, and i just very thankful that they're here. It means a whole lot. Um, I couldn't do it without God. I mean, he helped me this whole week. He put me under. Um, I wasn't nervous, wasn't stressed. Um, and he just helped me so much. Me and my dad, we came here safely. Um, this, this all for him. Um, it means a lot for me personally, so. It hasn't hit me yet, to be honest. Like, I just, it hasn't hit me yet right now, but I feel, feel good, yeah. It means a lot to me. Um, I've been kind of knocking at the door, all these AJJs that I've been playing, and you know, not really showing up, so it's great to finally show up at this one. And um, I played here last year and didn't do so well, so it's good to come back and get the W. I'd just like to thank the city of Robinson and all the volunteers for coming out here. They put on a smile on every hole, and it was just like, I'm so thankful for all of their support. And I'd also like to thank the AJGA staff for making this event so great.